So ladies and gentlemen, you are all welcome. I wanted to introduce you to my e-learning website where you can register and get access to our reading materials. And these reading materials include videos, question papers, fees. And after all, after you complete a particular course, you will also get a certificate. So to register with the website, you actually go to your browser and search for Dararefi sch.com.ng and you click on it. After clicking, then it will take you to the website. So this is the website. So for you to um, actually uh, register with the courses, you have to register with the site first. So how to register with the site, you see that we have uh, you click on the menu and on our menus, we have home dashboard courses, my account, student registration, instructor registration, contact us and about us. So if you did not register with the website, you have to click on student registration. So after clicking on the student registration, then it will now take you where to a page where you are going to actually put your details which include your name, last name, username, email address, and your password. And then you confirm your password. After you successfully register, after you successfully register, then you will now use the login details, which is the username and the password to log into the website. And how do you log into the website after registration? Then you click on my account. So after clicking on my account, and you, it will take you to this page where you are going to use your username and the password. So like, for example, in my own case, I have already registered with the website. So I already registered with the website. So these are my, the log, these are my login details. So I'll now click on login. You see, after login, then it will take you to a page where you see dashboard orders, download address, payment methods, account details, and then log out. So like in my own case, I have already registered with some courses. So I can now come back and click on dashboard. After I log in successfully, so I will now come back and click on dashboard. So after clicking on the dashboard, then it will take me to the page where it will show me the courses that I actually enrolled. So you see, in this case, I enrolled in six different courses and the active, I, and I have five active courses and one completed. So after completing each and every course, then like, for example, in the website, there are 14 courses available already because I am the admin. That is why it is showing me this. So you see, in this case, I have the biochemistry of macromolecules and of course which i already enrolled and then metabolism that is general general metabolism and there is a chemistry as introduction to physical chemistry mathematics algebra and then general physiology so these are the courses that i already enrolled these are the courses that i already enrolled and each of these courses these are the number of students that are enrolled general physiology one student general microbiology two General chemistry for 100 level student 10, chemistry of macromolecules 9, and then general metabolisms. We, I have 49 students that enroll in the course. So like for example, in the case where you register as a student, so what you are going to do first, because in my own case is because I already enrolled in, in some courses. So if you did not enroll in any courses after registration, then you go to my account. You log into the account and then the next thing, you don't need to go to the dashboard in this case. You have to go to courses here. So you click on the courses and it will take you to a feature where you will see all the available courses and then you select the course that you are interested on. Like for example, in my own cases, you see general chemistry, uh, general physiology 2000, general microbiology 1500. So let me actually, so you see, general 
chemistry of macro molecules so is because i already er, er, uh, i already enrolled that is why it is showing start lining so if you did not enroll it will not show you this start lining it will show you something like this so like for example in the case of general physiology i did not enroll so if i want to enroll in general physiology what am i going to do so i have to click on add so after clicking on add then the next thing is view to cut so after clicking on view to cut then it will now take me to a feature like this so you see it is showing uh so you see because i already so you see already there is chemistry or uh, general chemistry or chemistry for 100 level and then general physiology so why am i seeing these two is because is because I also uh, already add chemistry 400 level student. So I can now cancel it if I'm only interested in general physiology. So it, you see it's now removed successfully. So I ha only have general physiology, that is physiology. So I have to pay 2000 before I enroll. So how am I going to pay? So you click on proceed to cut. So after clicking on proceed to cut, it will take you here where you are going to have your billing details. So you write your name, like in my own case, the billing details, I have my name, I leave you and then last name Mukhtar. Then if you have any company name, then you write it. And if you don't have any company name, then you ignore it. Then you now put your address, street address. Then you now add, uh, that is the second address. Then you now write your account. You write your phone number, state and everything. And then after you do that, so because I already uh, enrolled on some courses and that is why I don't need to put any details. But if you are new and you did enroll in any course, you have to put all these, your details, your first name, your name, your, uh, your company name, which is optional, is not compulsory. You write to a street address. So you write everything. So after you successfully do that, then the next thing is click on debit and debit and credit card. So after clicking on debit and credit cards, then you click on place order. So after clicking on place order, After clicking on place order, you see it is now loading. So you see after clicking on place order, it will kill, it will give you different payment option cut. So if you want to pay with cut, then you click on cut and it will now show you where you are going to input your uh, 12 digit numbers. So after putting your after putting your 12 digit number after putting your 12 digit number then the next thing is uh, so after inputting your 16 digit numbers after putting your 16 digit number you put cut expiry date and then cvv or you can decide to use transfer so if you want to use transfer then you now take this account number and the bank name is Paste tag Titan and then you make the payment. Or you can decide to use USSD. You can also decide to use uh, Visa QR. You can use a pay account. So all these are the different payment methods. So after you take it and make the payment, then it will successfully, it will successfully, uh, it will successfully enroll you in the course you selected and make payment. So ladies and gentlemen, try to register with this website. The website is a tutorial website where you can have a videos, compiled videos, where you can have compiled write-off, where you can also have some relevant questions related to any course you registered with. The metabolism, the chemistry of macromolecules, the chemistry itself, you can all have... Uh, access to that full details it is very affordable it is very cheap and try to register it is specifically made for tutorial 
which will easily help and ease your learning. Thank you very much. And uh, I would like to be happy after registering. And of course, if you have any problem with the payment or with getting access to the website, you can actually message me on the comment section. Thank you very much.